Ladies and gentlemen, he is back. American astronaut Scott Kelly returned from the International Space Station yesterday after spending almost a full year in space. Incredible. <laughs> A record-breaking year in space, so I guess that means that my ten months in space are now completely irrelevant. <laughs> Thanks, Scott. But upon returning, and this is true, Scott Kelly measured two inches taller. And this is due to his vertebrae not being compressed in a low-gravity environment and the fact that he started wearing heels. <laughs> Space changes a man. Uh, but this is incredible. You can grow two inches? I mean, I hear that promise from my spam emails every day. <laughs> I didn't believe it, but I took on now. But when he landed, waiting for him on the tarmac was Jill Biden, uh, Joe Biden's wife. And I'm going to say it right now. There's got to be an easier way to meet Jill Biden. <laughs> I mean, a year in space gets you a meet and greet with the vice president's wife. <laughs> what do you have to do to meet the president? Like, I feel like Obama meets everyone. He's met Ludacris. He's met Zach Braff. <laughs> He's met the champions of the WNBA. A guy lives in space for almost an entire year, and Obama's like, send Joe Biden's <laughs> wife. With a wife. <laughs> um... <laughs> now... Clearly, Scott Kelly's been gone for a long time, but one thing he definitely didn't lose in space is his sense of humour. Take a look at him talking about his flight from the drop zone to his hometown in Houston. I know it's late, and uh, it would have been great to get here quicker. Um, I'm used to going 17,500 miles an hour, but this airplane doesn't do quite that. Woo! Banger! <laughs> I mean, you just know that later he was defending that joke, going, uh, well, actually, that joke works a lot better in space. Like, <laughs> when I told that up there, God, that Russian guy laughed pretty hard. <laughs> He's actually right. This was the reaction to that joke over at NASA. 